Hello, good morning viewers. Welcome back to MDC News. Good to be with you. I'm Aina Maharani and I will give you the hardest information from all around the world. And here's the news in details. Students' mental health needs to be maintained during online learning periods. The COVID-19 pandemic has proved to have serious effects on students' mental health especially when there's a big change in learning patterns from face-to-face -face learning to online learning during the COVID-19 pandemic has taken a very serious toll on people's mental health, especially for students. The result of a survey by Indonesian psychiatrists in 2020 shows that 64.3% of the population suffer from depression and anxiety, especially students. At a survey of WHO or World Health Organization, who found that up to 50% of mental health disasters can date back to adolescence age 14. The Indonesian Ministry of Health has pointed out in its basic health research report that the prevalence of school age emotional disasters over 15 years is also increasing by 7% from 2013 until 2020. Six things can affect the health of children during the pandemic social isolation, long range learning, staring at the cell phone, fear of viruses, and lack of physical activity. In addition, the atmosphere away from friends and teachers makes students tend to be passive and saturated, even some students lose the motivation to learn. Even for the sudden changes in life patterns can cause students to have difficulty in sleeping. Based on the study of Warwick University Department of Computer Science England and Fudan University China, 11,000 of 9 to 11 year olds found that 53% of children under 7 hours had behavioral problems. According to our research team's data, some students have different ways of avoiding mental health issues. I got a little stressed out when the learning system changed for the first time, but now I can avoid it. I'm usually doing self-healing, just like fangirling, submitting my tasks on time so then I can play social media and comfort myself," said Aura, one of SMA Negeri Tiga Pekalongan students. Whereas other students said that they avoid mental health issues by doing their hobby and spending time with their family. During this pandemic, the students should be able to handle themselves. There are so many good activities they can do in order not to make them stress. Sat Kak Seto on Teenagers and Mental Health Online Webinar in SMA Negeri Tiga Pekalongan. Students should be able to use their teenage school time as good as possible so that they don't regret it in the future. By doing fun activity and enjoy their life like they used to be, it will be good for them physically and mentally. Well viewers, that's all information for today. For the latest information, you can visit our website on www.mbcnews.com And don't forget to follow our Instagram at mbcnews.official I'm Aina Maharani, thank you for watching and have a nice day!